watching Hell's Paradise episode 5. In the last episode, we had the purple haired uh, ninja lady as well, whose name I've forgotten. She's right there. Right there. Um, join up with Gabby Mato. She seems a little bit. She seems a lot sus. But, um, I mean, she, she was very upfront about the fact that. You know, the fact that she she could kill him at any point and uh, at some point they're going to have to fight. Only one person is going to make off the island, which I think Gabby Mara is like, yeah, fair enough. Um, it also helps having the extra backup, considering they've also got two of the Yamada clan with her as well. Um, yeah, and then as well as the Bakugo, I'm going to remember the names eventually, and his brother who became one of part of the Yamada clan to oversee him, which is crazy. Uh, they popped off as well. So yeah, overall, I'm looking forward to this as we explore this mysterious land, um, as well as meeting the other prisoners as well to see how they will comply with each other. Uh, but yeah, let's get right into this episode right now. Oh, Sagadi passed out as well, didn't she? I was still looking um, back at the episode and it was possibly because like there was a bunch of spores and shit around her. Maybe that's what made her get knocked out. A cavern. That's a tree trunk. Yeah, that's what I thought. It's like the spores and shit. What is he doing? He's making food or medicine? Look at her sleeping in the tree. Supervising. Bro's kind of kind of built. This dude got De Deku's voice actor. Did I say that in the last episode? I feel like I recognized this in the last episode. How long are they going to be exploring this? How big is the island? Well, that was a lie. Yo. That's creepy as shit. So the elixir of life looks like a mandarin. Is that is this what we're saying? I thought it, I just thought it'd be like some kind of fucking waterfall, or just like lake of elixir or something like that. I don't know. These statues are freaky, bro. Oh uh, yeah. But if somebody was living on this island, they'd be a problem. So they don't have dicks. Nice. So basically, the island was made by AI. That's why everyone looks like something, but kind of fucked up. Are you okay, Gabi Maru? Well, at least the, the group's got a plan, and we got some brain cells between them. Why is everybody? Why is everybody telling us to fuck off? Get out of here. She's trying to do her job. Or do you want to end up like the red-headed dude as well? He's looking out for her. I understand. But only because she's a woman. Do you? Have you tried? Oh, she's using a random sword. Everybody's hating on her, man. Jesus. He's talking mad shit for someone who's probably going to die. Jesus, dude. Oh, this guy's retreating? This guy has good intentions, but uh, the Shogun's not going to let this person off like that. What the fuck? Big ass ship. It's a ghost ship. Oh no, it's just a a, a broken ship. The ship graveyard. Zombie? Oh no, weird creatures. All right, so you can't escape this island unless the island wants you to. Great. It's a kraken. It's a really fucked up kraken. Bro, you got these people back to the village and they killed them all? Ugh. Oh. 
That's so fucked up. People just going around killing natives and shit. Awful. So this kid isn't even like a criminal. He did nothing. He just he just existed. Yeah, purple haired dude. Well, what the fuck? Hey yo. Well, I guess it wasn't a good idea that he got off early. This kid's probably not built for this, and I do not blame him. Poor kid, bro. Blaming all this shit on himself. Don't use big words. Oh shit, he let him touch it. Damn, Yamada clan are kinda nasty. I hope this dude doesn't die, he's a nice guy. Did they both make it? Oh my god, they are bloody to shit. Bro, these monsters were like, bro, you're going outside the map, you're going out of bounds. We need to sort you out straight away. How do they even get to the island? It's like the monsters allowed them in. It's a girl? She's a girl? Damn. Yeah! She's naked to the world. I've fallen for your chivalry. Yeah, these guys would be good allies. They're not bad people. This guy's so annoying. No. As we've just seen, no, you should not leave this place. Samurai simply obey. It's like a completely different person, though. Level habit Gary Maru. We love to see it. Stronger than me? I don't know about that, Chief. True. This is why she shouldn't leave. She needs, still needs to learn more about the world and about herself. I think she's really starting to not see this guy as a criminal. Even though he killed a lot of people. Yeah, and you better accept that for an answer, bitch. How about a lop off your fucking head? Live for yourself and your own dreams. Bro, you're talking mad shit. If he doesn't listen after this, Gabi Mario better just pull up and just knock his head off. Didn't that dude lose his hand? Was it the left hand or right hand? Alright, you gotta die. That's it. Yeah, pull out your sword. I dare you. I'll be taking this sword. Oh. Motherfucker, damn. How did you sneak up? Oh. He bitch slapped his stomach out of him. Right, so that was another good episode of Hell's Paradise, episode 5. Um, yeah, I'm really enjoying Sagadi's character development here and progression. Um, nobody in this world wants her to succeed. My god, it's like all she see, they see her for is her gender. When she's kind of nasty. Um, but yeah, I was hoping that she was about to fuck this dude up. But big old giant man came along and did it anyway. So yeah, bro didn't even last the episode. He's, I mean, he's at this point. Not dead, but he's dying. So, yeah, we stand. Overall, a, a very good episode. I'm really liking how Gabby Mario is now after he's like kind of calmed down thanks to Sagiri as well. I'm also liking the other groups. There's uh, the dynamics between them. We've got this other group who are very nice the blonde guy and the little girl. Um, hopefully, we meet up with them soon because they're clearly good people and we can trust them so they can join the group. Um, but yeah, overall, a very good episode, and I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.